accept versus accept. Accept, to receive or take something willingly. Example, she accepted the job offer. Accept, to exclude or leave out. Example, everyone passed the test except Sarah. Adapt versus adopt. Adapt, to modify or adjust to new conditions. Example, the company had to adapt its strategies to the changing market. Adopt, to take something on or embrace, such as a new idea or a pet. Example, they decided to adopt a healthier lifestyle. Affect versus effect. Affect, to influence or impact. Example, the weather can affect my mood. Effect, the result or outcome. Example, the new policy had a positive effect on productivity. Allude versus elude. Allude, to indirectly refer to something. Example, she alluded to her difficult past without going into detail. Elude, to escape from or avoid. Example, the criminal managed to elude capture for weeks. Assure versus ensure versus ensure. Assure, to promise or make someone confident. Example, he assured me that the project would be completed on time. Ensure, to make sure or guarantee. Example, proper planning will ensure success. Ensure, to provide insurance coverage. Example, they insured their car against accidents. Canvas versus canvas. Canvas, a type of strong, heavy fabric. Example, the artist painted on a canvas. Canvas, to solicit votes, opinions, or support. Example, volunteers went door to door to canvas for the upcoming election. Compliment versus compliment. Compliment, something that completes or goes well with something else. Example, the wine was a perfect complement to the meal. Compliment, an expression of praise or admiration. Example, she received a compliment on her presentation skills. Conscious versus conscience. Conscious, aware or awake. Example, she was conscious of her surroundings. Conscience, inner sense of right and wrong. Example, his conscience wouldn't allow him to cheat on the exam. Diffuse versus diffuse. Diffuse, to make a situation less tense or dangerous. Example, the negotiator worked to defuse the hostage situation. Diffuse, to spread out or disperse. Example, the fragrance diffused throughout the room. Desert, noun, versus desert, verb. Desert, Noun a dry, sandy, and arid region. Example, the Sahara is a famous desert. Desert, verb to abandon or leave behind. Example, he deserted his post during the night. Disinterested versus uninterested. Disinterested, impartial or unbiased. Example, the judge remained disinterested during the trial. Uninterested not interested or indifferent. Example, she seemed uninterested in the topic. Illicit versus illicit. Illicit, to draw out or evoke a response or reaction. Example, the teacher tried to elicit thoughtful answers from the students. Illicit, illegal or forbidden. Example, the police confiscated the illicit drugs. Farther versus further. Farther, referring to physical distance. Example, the campsite is farther down the trail. Further, referring to extent or advancement. Example, she wanted to further her research. Flaunt versus flout. Flaunt, to show off or display something proudly. Example, she liked to flaunt her designer clothes. Flout to openly disregard or mock rules. Example, some drivers flout traffic regulations. Forward versus forward. Forward, an introduction at the beginning of a book. 
Example, the author wrote a heartfelt foreword to her novel. Forward, moving ahead or sending something ahead. Example, please forward the email to the team. Imply versus infer. Imply, to suggest indirectly. Example, his tone implied that he was displeased. Infer, to deduce or conclude from evidence. Example, from his words, we can infer his opinion. Lay versus lie. Lay, to place something down. Example, please lay the book on the table. Lie, to recline or be in a resting position. Example, the cat will lie on the couch. Loose versus loose. Loose, not tight or secure. Example, her shoelaces were loose. Lose, to misplace or not win. Example, if you don't study, you'll lose marks. Moral versus morale. Moral, relating to principles of right and wrong. Example, the story taught a moral lesson. Morale, the emotional or mental state of a group. Example, the team's morale was boosted after the victory. Past versus past. Past, referring to time that has gone by. Example, he discussed his past experiences. Past, the past tense of pass. Example, she passed the test with flying colors. Personal versus personnel. Personal, relating to an individual. Example, this is my personal opinion. Personnel, employees or staff. Example, the company is hiring new personnel. Principle versus principle. Principle, a fundamental belief or rule. Example, she adheres to ethical principles. Principle, the head of a school or main amount of money. Example, the principal announced the school's closure. Quiet versus quiet. Quiet, a lack of noise. Example, the library was quiet. Quiet, to a considerable extent. Example, the movie was quite entertaining. Stationary versus stationary. Stationary, not moving. Example, the car remains stationary at the traffic light. Stationary, writing materials like paper and pens. Example, she bought new stationery for her office. There versus there versus there. There, belonging to them. Example, their dog is very playful. There, referring to a place. Example, the keys are over there. There, contraction of they are. Example, they're going to the park. Through versus through versus thorough. Through, past tense of throw. Example, he threw the ball to his friend. Through, moving from one side to the other. Example, we walked through the park. Thorough, complete or detailed. Example, she did a thorough analysis of the data. Two versus two versus two. Two, used as a preposition. Example, she went to the store. Two, indicating excess or also. Example, it's too hot today. Two, the number two. Example, we have two apples. Weather versus weather. Weather, the atmospheric conditions. Example, the weather is sunny today. Weather, expressing a choice between alternatives. Example, she wasn't sure whether to attend the event. Whose versus whose. Whose, contraction of who is or who has. Example, who's coming to the party. Whose, possessive form of who. Example, whose book is this. Your versus your. Your, belonging to you. Example, is this your bag? Your, contraction of you are. Example, you're doing a great job. Advice versus advice. Advice, 
noun referring to suggestions or recommendations. Example, she gave me some good advice. Advice, verb meaning to give advice. Example, I advise you to study regularly. Breath versus breathe. Breath, noun referring to the air taken in and expelled during breathing. Example, take a deep breath. Breathe, verb meaning to inhale and exhale air. Example, breathe deeply to relax. Sight versus sight versus sight. Sight, verb meaning to quote or reference. Example, he cited several sources in his paper. Site, noun referring to a location. Example, the construction site is busy. Site, noun referring to the ability to see or something seen. Example, the view from the hill was a beautiful site. Compliment versus compliment. Compliment, noun referring to something that completes or matches something else. Example, the wine was a perfect complement to the meal. Compliment, noun or verb referring to a polite expression of praise or admiration. Example, she received a compliment on her hairstyle. Eminent versus imminent. Eminent, distinguished or famous. Example, the scientist was an eminent figure in the field. Imminent, about to happen often referring to something negative. Example, the storm's arrival was imminent. Historic versus historical. Historic, relating to an important event in history. Example, the signing of the declaration was a historic moment. Historical, relating to history in general. Example, he enjoyed reading about historical events. It's versus it's. It's, possessive form of it. Example, the cat licked its paw. It's, contraction of it is or it has. Example, it's raining outside. Lead versus lead. Lead, noun referring to a heavy, soft, bluish gray metal. Example, the pencil contained lead. Lead, past tense of lead. Example, she led the team to victory. Mood versus mute. Mood, open to debate or discussion. Example, the issue is still mood. Mute, adjective referring to silence or a person unable to speak. Example, she remained mute during the meeting. Peak versus peak versus peak. Peak, noun referring to the top of a mountain or a high point. Example, they reached the peak of the mountain. Peak, verb meaning to glance quickly. Example, she took a peek at the surprise. Peak, noun or verb referring to a feeling of annoyance or interest. Example, his comment caused her to peek. Populous versus populous. Populous, noun referring to the general population. Example, the policy affects the entire populace. Populous, adjective meaning densely populated. Example, Tokyo is one of the world's most populous cities. Principle versus principle. Principle, noun referring to a fundamental belief or rule. Example, honesty is an important principle. Principle, noun referring to the head of a school or main amount of money. Example, the principal welcomed the students. Rain versus rain versus rain. Rain, noun referring to a ruler's period of power. Example, Queen Victoria's reign was significant. Rain, noun referring to a strap used to control an animal. Example, he pulled on the reins to slow down the horse. Rain, noun referring to water falling from the sky. Example, we cancelled the picnic due to heavy rain. Then versus then. Then, used for making comparisons. Example, she is taller than her sister. Then, referring to a specific time or sequence. Example, we went to the park, and then we had lunch. 
to verses 2 verses 2. 2. Preposition indicating direction or purpose. Example, we're going to the movies. 2. Indicating excess or also. Example, the cake was too sweet. 2. The number 2. Example, I have two cats. Wave versus wave. Wave, verb meaning to give up or relinquish a right. Example, he decided to waive his right to compensation. Wave, noun referring to a gesture of the hand or a moving ridge on the surface of water. Example, she waved to her friend across the street. Wander versus wonder. Wander, verb meaning to roam or move around aimlessly. Example, they decided to wander through the forest. Wonder, noun or verb referring to a feeling of curiosity or amazement. Example, she wondered about the origins of the ancient artifact. Weather versus weather. Weather, noun referring to the atmospheric conditions. Example, the weather is sunny today. Weather, conjunction introducing alternatives or possibilities. Example, I'm not sure whether we should go or stay. Whose versus whose. Whose, contraction of who is or who has. Example, who's coming to the party. Whose, possessive form of who. Example, whose book is this. Your versus your. Your, possessive form of you. Example, is this your bag? Your, contraction of you are. Example, you're doing a great job.